During the days of the Republic, Mon Mothma was the senator of Chandrilla. When the Clone Wars began, she was appointed by Chancellor Palpatine to be a member of the Loyalist Committee that would help maintain the integrity of the Republic. She was very outspoken in her opinion that a peaceful resolution could be found between the Confederacy and her own government. She also opposed the increasing power that was granted to Chancellor Palpatine during the conflict, but she could not derail his complete takeover of the Republic and the transition to the Galactic Empire. Although she remained a member of the Imperial Senate, she worked with Bail Organa to spark a rebellion throughout the galaxy. When the Senate was dissolved and Organa was killed in the destruction of Alderaan, Mothma became the political leader and voice of the Rebel Alliance. She held her position through the conclusion of the Galactic Civil War and was elected as the first Chancellor of the New Republic shortly following the Battle of Endor. The Senate was reinstated and relocated to Chandrilla. With the signing of the Galactic Concordance and the official end of the Galactic Civil War, she removed the Chancellor's emergency powers that had been set in place during the Clone Wars and created the Military Disarmament Act, which reduced the New Republic Starfleet by 90% in hopes that doing so would remove the future threat of another galaxy-wide dictatorship. It's recently been revealed that Mothma will be making her film reappearance in Rogue One, where we should get more of a sense of her leadership style and skills. That's it for today. Please subscribe, like, and share to see new Star Wars videos every weekday. And if there's a specific Star Wars topic you'd like me to cover, leave it in the comments and I'll do an episode about it. As always, thank you for watching, and may the Force be with you.